So if you're looking at it. Okay, I'm gonna build a couple of doors because I want to have a, a door going outside because I do have a little bit of space, some uh, some space outside the run. It's like a little bit of a free ranging. But I, so I'm gonna put a door that goes up and down. But I'm gonna build my own, but I'm gonna show you how. This is the one I'm. This is my one I'm gonna use. So I just, uh, I just bent my angle, got it coming over, up, and over, but I can make this easy in the shop. I know so a lot of people can't do that, but we'll build a different one, too. So, and then, you know, your door, so your door will slide. So the door, and then I'll, I'll come back and I'll cut my hole, whatever my hole is going to be. So that, and then I won't build another one. I'm just going to use an angle. So it'll just be some angle. Some like two inch by two inch probably. I made that, but you, there's some, some aluminum over at Home Depot. 48 inches. You could probably buy one of those and cut it in half. Then you'd have 24. 24 inches might be enough. I don't know. Mine are a little longer, but have to see then the door the door will slide so I can just screw the angle right to my wood this this is nothing here I just, I just needed that because that I need a little bit of a space because I want a little bit of play in there I don't want it really tight that's all these are so this will actually just sit like that and then the door will slide Hold it in there. And then I, so I'm going, this one I'm just building, just the, this one's mine. This one's, he's, it's actually easier for me to build that one than that one. But anyway, and then I got my lock. I want to do a lock on the bottom here. So this will be my lock. So the door will come down. So. I'll have my lock. So I'll have my bolt, it'll be bolted on here. And then my string will be hooked there. And uh, so when I pull up, that'll turn like that. Then go up. And it comes back down. Comes back down. This will be on the one bolt and it will swing. This will swing down and lock. I'll notch this right here. That will. This part will come down and lock onto a bolt. So that'll just slide right in. Then that'll be the lock. You can't pull it up unless you pull this up here from the string. So. Then that lets you do a couple different options. Because uh, well, you get a lot better door. This is a lot this door is a lot nicer door with a should be with a pretty decent lock simple you know bolt here string there bolt here going through this it's salt that's locked and then it, that just locks right on there hopefully it works so I'm gonna build this one first because I need to see how I want to piece this one together over here so I've got this this one done. So that's kind of where I'm going to put the door right here. There's a so so it won't it won't pull up. So there's no way to pull it up because it's locked. And then if you pull it with the thing then it unlocks so it just comes down locks and you just pull it up so I just got to cut my hole somehow I'm gonna have to I'm gonna mount it right right about right there probably just gonna screw it right in right there Uh, 
So I, I, you can see my chickens down there. There's eight of them I got running around. Yeah. I'm just letting them out for a minute. So I put this one in. All I did here was put these two by fours. And that that gave me a little bit of space behind so I could still put that lock on the on the one side. So you can put it right there like that. Then you, you would still have to figure out some way that that lock would latch. I got my deal in there. So you just take two two by fours and screw it and then some angle. Just straight up angle. I don't need this one. I won't take it off. On the inside, if I put that on the inside, I would have to I would prefer to do this angle. Because if you just do angle here, there, and there like that, you don't need this right here. But if it's just these then you can just screw it right to the framing and that's your door. That's the, this I can just, I make this so easy that building a door like that, then I could just put that on the inside and put a lock. I was gonna do that, but if you, you if you just want it like on this side, you have to put a two by four and then that gives you enough space behind. So like all I did was do this lock, you no know, bolt. That's an easy, easy lock. There's no way, there's no way they can get that to come back. The only way you can get it is by opening it like that. And uh, my slider door, I just got this cable that I ran. That lock system works pretty good. I might do just a separate little video on, on that. So I've got the, the lock deal that I showed you. You can't pull that up unless you pull the string up. So if you're looking at it, 